देश को ना तो अकेला कर्नल लूथरा बचा सकता है ना ही कोई टाइगर ना कबीर और ना ही पठान सबकी जरूरत है हमें Belated happy Diwali to all of you. Hope your Diwali was really good and you guys had a good time. Kai saal pehle ek picture release hui thi Ek Tha Tiger. That's how the Tiger franchise actually started. Uh, it was a super hit movie directed by Kabir Khan. Um, Bollywood should have stopped right there. <laughs> but but inko paise ki kuch li ho rahi thi shayad and they ended up making Tiger 2 uh, which is Tiger Zinda hai. And that was an okay movie. ठीक ही थी वो इफ यू नॉट सीन दीज टू यू आर प्रॉबली लिविंग अंडर अ रॉक यू गैस शुड गो एंड सी दैट फर्स्ट बिफोर वॉचिंग टाइगर थ्री विच इज वॉट आई एम गोन टॉक अबाउट तो टाइगर वन और टाइगर टू के बाद दे शुड स्टॉप राइट देयर दे शुड नॉट हैव डन एनी थिंग देन दिस हैपन कहानी एक था टाइगर के साथ शुरू होकर टाइगर जिंदा है तक तक पहुंची है वो वहीं न रुके अब नमो ने ऐलान कर ही दिया है तो हु इज स्टॉपिंग दैम राइट तो मनीष शर्मा एंड वाई आर एफ एंड आदित्य चोपड़ा गॉट देर हेड्स टूगेदर एंड देन दे क्रिएटेड टाइगर थ्री विच इज वॉट वी आर गोन टॉक अबाउट टूडे वेल आई गॉट अ चांस टू सी टाइगर थ्री लास्ट वीक एंड एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई गिव यू ब्रीफ्स इन ऑप्सिस टाइगर इज अबाउट अविनाश राठौड़ प्लेड बाई सलमान खान ही इज अ रॉ एजेंट and he's now married to his isi adventurer azoya played by katrina kaif uh, they are now um, married and they have a kid who's probably in his teens preteens um he is on a standard rescue mission in the beginning of the movie and somewhere along the story he goes rogue uh, to save his son's life and um, eventually everyone finds out that he's actually on a mission to save his wife's nation uh, i mean <laughs> pakistan <laughs> from a maniac um who wants to take over the uh, nation uh, he wants to take over pakistan <laughs> and that maniac is played by imran hashmi uh, i don't know who wants to take over pakistan and <laughs> destroy himself but that's how the story goes um, you can call it an indo pak uh, jodo yatra kind of a thing theek <laughs> hai as opposed to what rahul gandhi was doing which is uh, bharat jodo yatra this is a भारत पाकिस्तान जोड़ो यात्रा स्टोरी राइट मे बी टाइगर थ्री वॉन्ट्स टू प्रूव दैट दे आर बेटर देन राहुल गांधी ठीक है वेल इन सब के बीच में ही इज जॉइन बाय पठान प्लेड बाय शाहरुख खान ऑब्वियसली हु इज ट्राइंग टू रिप्राइज दैट रोल दैट ही डेड इन पठान एंड ही इज ऑब्वियसली रिटर्निंग अ फेवर दैट टाइगर डेड टू हेम वेन ही वॉज स्टक तो देर इज दैट एलिमेंट टू इट टू सो वेल uh let me quickly get to the good bad and the ugly of the movie so that you guys can decide if you want to watch the movie if you have not seen it already right so here goes well some of the action pieces were really good especially the first rescue scene uh was really well shot and choreographed um especially the drone shots that they took um moving from one side to the other they were standard drone shots there was nothing spectacular no fpv stuff happening but um it was very well shot and edited i thought i thought that was a fantastic sequence that they built and it uh, helped the movie take off really well uh, also talking about action the turkish bath scene between katrina kaif and whoever the asian star was i don't know who she was she was really good too was uh, the fight sequence in that turkish bath was very well choreographed i thought it was very tight uh, it is hard to shoot something like that so i think they did a very good job it was a very unique sequence in uh, an indian movie that i saw i i think it was very well done uh, although i feel like the jump cuts could have been avoided but uh, i think uh, that's worth the mention i think that was one of the highlights of the movie i think the biggest highlight was uh, salman actually acted instead of uh, i mean <laughs> normally uske movie mein aise khada hota hai aise karta hai aise karta hai and aise aise dekhta hai na aur aise aise hilta hai वो नहीं कर रहा था ही वॉज एक्चुअली डूइंग लॉट ऑफ डिसेंट एक्टिंग इवन क्राइड इन वन ऑफ दीन्स विच वॉज एक्चुअली कॉमिकल बट थोड़ा बहुत इमोशन भी दिखाया था उसने 
but uh, salman did uh, a better job in this movie than his last previous movies the rade and all that stuff that uh, came out in his recent years um usne kafi achhi acting ki thi uh, and i think that's worth a mention well the other thing that was a bit of a surprise to me was uh, imran hashmi as uh, the antagonist i thought he did a, he did a good job uh, although i won't give him high marks um i thought uh, the character was very subdued although in the interviews uh, that imran hashmi did after the movie he clearly said that uh, the character that he was playing was more like a mind uh, game player he was more like uh, plays uh, his things uh, like a chess game but phir bhi yaar if you are trying to take over a nation uh, be it pakistan whatever theek hai <laughs> Uh, he needs to look a little more menacing i thought the character was not properly written but jo bhi tha wherever scenes he came in um, i think he did a pretty decent job uh, i think that was a bit of a surprise to me although i wish uh, they would have given him more footage i think he would have done a better job and even his character could have been better written uh, but overall jitna bhi diya gaya tha usko i think he played a pretty good role Uh, i think that was a surprise to me i didn't expect imran hashmi to take uh, do such a good job as a bad guy he's more of a romantic hero right um i was told that uh, junior ntr was supposed to play this role i'm not sure uh, fact check karna padega if somebody can find out and write down in the comments just let me know but um, initially junior ntr was supposed to play that role but imran hashmi eventually ended up playing that role i might be wrong but uh, whatever he did he did a very good job The other thing that's worth mentioning was the pre-climax scene in the bunker um between Imran Hashmi and Salman Khan. Um that fight sequence was very well done. I thought it was very well chore- choreographed. It was very well choreographed and it was very colorized as well. Um there was uh, that orangish glaze that they got into the sequence was uh, was very nice actually. Mujhe bahut acha laga. It was very uniquely presented um as a as a pre-climax scene. um and i was surprised manish sharma is not an action director i was um, manish sharma is more known for romantic comedies like um, band by barat and all that stuff right ladies was rocky bell and all those type of movies so it was a big risk that uh, they took uh, to have him direct an action sequence like this or an action movie like this but that sequence really stood out for me uh, that and the first sequence that i was talking about the bike chase scenes um both were really good but the pre climax scene was uh, was worth uh, mentioning so that was one of the good elements to the movie now let's get to the bad and the ugly that's the most critical thing right good to theek hai acha tha picture mein jo bhi tha jo maine bataya uh bad number 1 the cgi uh, i think the cgi was not good it was actually subpar i wish they had spent more money on cgi um i don't know the red chilies ka vfx seems a lot better than what wire of uh, uses um a lot of uh, sequences looked a little fake to me in the backdrop uh, as a lag raha tha ki uh, this is cgi right you should know that uh, especially during action sequences um but especially this salman khan um, shahrukh khan interaction and that fight sequence that was choreographed that looked very falsified as a lag raha tha ki cgi se bana hua hai you should know that Uh, but cgi was uh, was subpar in my opinion uh, the other thing i really did not like was patan's entry um, it was atrocious i can't even describe how comical it was it was badly timed um, there was no goosebump moments about it uh, which i was expecting jaise when tiger entered uh, in patan it was it was like a goosebump moment right but aisa nahi tha isme and it was very cheesily done and uh, talking about cheesy they had some cheesy dialogues with references to shole uh, and they should have kept it very short that entire sequence they extended beyond par yaar wo bridge mein jo explosions ho rahe hain ye dono kood rahe hain idhar se udhar uh, and the way they are talking to each other uh, it was all very unnecessary i think uh, that particular thing they blew it they had one chance for introducing sharukh into the sequence and kind of build that pace right uh, that would have taken that uh, movie to a different level but i think they blew it uh, i didn't really like it the other thing i really did not like was katrina kaif's look uh, i think she almost looked pa- plasticky lag rahi thi kafi uh, for a lack of a better word um, and uh, she almost looked like she had gone through a radical 
रिकन्स्ट्रक्टिव सर्जरी उसका फेस पता नहीं एज अ श्रंक था आई डोंट नो बिकॉज ऑफ सी जी आई और वेदर शी एड डन समथिंग टू हर फेस इट लुक्स लाइक शी वेंट थ्रू एन ओवरऑल इन इन हर फेशियल स्ट्रक्चर आई थिंक बट शी डिड लुक वेरी हार्ड बट बिटवीन दीपिका इन पठान एंड कटरीना इन टाइगर I prefer uh, Katrina. Uh, I think she was very good in the fight sequences, especially the Turkish bath scene that I talked about. But um, look wise, I don't think she was looking very natural. I, I don't know what they did to her looks. Okay. Uh that was one thing I really did not enjoy or did not like. It was more of the bad ugly side of it. Um the other thing I really did not like was the placing of the songs. Uh Ruwa is a fantastic song by Arjit Singh. Uh, it was not necessary in the movie uh, they could have stuck it somewhere in youtube but uh, khair dal diya to dal diya anyhow i don't, i don't know how arjit ended up singing for salman uh, i thought they were going through some rough patch to, uh, between the two but kya pata dono ne aapas mein bharat milap kar liya hoga you never know but uh, arjit singh be doing a playback for salman was a surprise to me but the song ruwa is spectacular uh, it was uh, but it was not necessary it was just uh, breaking the movie quite a bit even the last song that they uh, they've started doing these days in the movie last may gana dal diya titles ke sath uh, i really didn't like it um, i don't think that song was necessary it actually makes you sit through a song to wait for what you want to see uh, which is the prequel to war right they have the uh, small without sp- i mean it's a it's a spoiler at this point but uh, they show a um, bit of uh, hrithik roshan uh, and uh, war 2 ka jo bhi story hone wala hai kind of right it's like a teaser like they do in marvel movies right um so that was there but you have to sit through that second song to actually get to that which was a little frustrating for me i thought both the songs were unnecessary they could have put them in youtube and be done with it and let the movie rip without songs ye pata nahi kyun aisa karte hain yaar itna bada action sequence aur action movie banate hain aur is beech mein gana dal dete hain ye log anyhow it is what it is but i didn't like uh, the two songs in the movie uh, well the bottom line is tiger 3 is uh, probably a one time watch you can still wait for the video to show up and watch it uh, in amazon prime which is where it's probably going to come out agar jaake paise udane hai to jaake dekh lo but uh, it's a one time watch no, at best uh, the fact that um, the uh, the premise of the story is about saving pakistan and him being the the good son in law i don't think it's going to sit well among patriotic indian audiences uh, <laughs> but okay uh, i think if you really guys uh, if you really want to watch the movie you can go ahead and watch it um it's a one time watch in my opinion ek the tiger tiger 1 was the best tiger movie ever made they should have stopped it right there and they should not have gotten into this uh, wire of spy universe kind of a thing and mixed up patan and war and all that stuff together uh, i think a note of advice to wire if if you guys are listening i think there is some misunderstanding about the term universe uh, <laughs> you guys are trying to imitate uh, marvel and dc stop doing that because first of all the elements or the superheroes in the dc and marvel universe have unique abilities like iron man has a specific strength uh, captain america has a specific strength uh, and the idea of bringing all these superheroes together to fight against a universal villain who is probably taking over a universe or the world is what encompasses marvel and dc right that's what a universe is that's what you're trying to create a pack of superheroes right yahan pe you are just trying to jumble up a couple of vagabonds like salman who has the same strength probably as sharukh who is probably just because you have muscle and can run around with machine guns doesn't make you a superhero yaar and in logon ke dimag mein the universe is sark countries uh, sri lanka pakistan इसी में घूम रहे हैं ये लोग तो डोंट कॉल इट अ यूनिवर्स नंबर वन डोंट कॉल इट अ सुपर हीरो मूवी बिकॉज यू गाइज आर नॉट सुपर हीरोज यू जस्ट एक्शन एडवेंचर मूवीज इट्स लाइक एक्सपेंडेबल्स राइट इफ यू आर कॉलिंग इट एन एक्सपेंडेबल टाइप ऑफ अ पिक्चर आई गेट दैट यू आर गेटिंग अ कपल ऑफ 
muscular guys who can weld machine guns and uh, start shooting uh, at whim and fancy uh, i i get that but this is not a universe a spy universe or whatever you want to call it uh, just get rid of that term don't try to mix and match uh, eventually log pak jayenge yaar because you're trying to show the same thing over and over again i know exactly war war to kya hone wala they are trying to do the same exact action adventure they'll probably end up bringing john abraham and um, um, somebody else in into the movie like patan might show up or salman khan might show up all three of them would start firing away with machine guns and trying to save uh, maybe china at this point i i don't know <laughs> but uh, i think eventually log pak jayenge that's my take on it they have to f- if they want to do something like that they have to build unique elements into the picture and that's just a piece of my advice and and i know they are going to continue this bs uh, through the rest of the movies and maybe have uh, siddhartha anand or someone direct war 2 and go up and i have actually titles lined up someday i'll uh, talk to you guys about it of uh, what tiger 4 tiger 5 tiger 6 tiger 7 and maybe till tiger 10 should look like i have a bunch of titles around it kisi <laughs> din uh, but uh, for now uh, if you guys really want to watch tiger go and watch it uh, agar paise bachane hai to fantastic uh, if you want to wait till amazon prime um, i think that would be the path i would take um, i don't think it's a movie that's going to make a thousand crores like patan did or jawan did or whatever uh, but um, it's a decent watch theek okay? hai but uh, that's all i have for today Uh, um till next time uh, eat a drink and enjoy life like i always say and we will catch up soon adios guys